Hi and welcome to my channel. Today I've got a great cardio kickboxing class for you. It is all low impact and no equipment needed. We're gonna be on our feet the whole time. Again, it's cardio, we're gonna get the heart rate pumping and we're gonna get our sweat on for sure today. Go ahead and join me. I'm wearing tennis shoes today and also grab a drink of water. Find a nice wide space where you've got some room to move around in. We're gonna get started with a warm up. Let's march in place. Big deep breath, arms go up and down. Again, arms go up, inhale, exhale down. One more time, arms up. Keep the march, arms change to shoulder rolls here, all the way up and back. If you guys did my other kickboxing workout, similar format, we're doing rounds. We've got four rounds, three moves to each round and doing those moves three times each. See, once you get it the first time, and then we just add on and you'll really get it down. Let's change our feet here to a little step touch, bending the knees, warming up those legs. Let's add some reaches to the corners. Check your posture. Our core is gonna stay nice and tight the whole time. Shoulders down, our guard is gonna be up. I'll show you what that is in a minute here. Now we're gonna change our arms to a punch to the side and turn a little bit more. So instead of that reaching, we're gonna turn to the side with a punch. Feeling that in your core. Punch it out. A few more here. Tap that toe, give me four. Three, two, come back to center here and bob and weave. So we're just taking this step touch and we're gonna come a little bit deeper. Tap that toe. What we're doing here is we're ducking a punch from somebody. And I want you to have your guard up. So we've got loose fists right here on the sides of your face, protecting our face. Good, breathe that out here. Sit the hips back nice and low. Give me four, three, two, and one. Back to center, and we're just gonna jump rope here. So shifting the weight, side to side. You can do doubles if you want. Feet don't come off the floor again, it's all low impact. Some of these moves can be a little bit tougher than others. I'll always give you modifications. Shoulders down, jumping rope here. A few more. As we jump rope here, I want you to turn to the side. Good, and then face me, I'm your opponent, look at me. Let's go ahead and steady those feet. Your guard is up and your front arm, I want you to jab towards me. And we're moving our torso here. Straight punch. Good, punch it forward, four, three, two. Back arm, I want you to twist. You're coming up onto that back toe, twisting. Give me a nice cross punch here, forward forward. Four more. We put those two together. Jab and cross. Here we go. Jab and cross. Jab and cross. Put a little force behind it. Cross. Jab it and cross. Three. Last one. Stay here. We're going to hook that front arm and then we're gonna come below with an uppercut. So we're gonna hook, uppercut, hook, uppercut. Putting our torso into it, and again, maybe coming up on that back toe, using our hips for a little more impact. Hook, uppercut. Let's pick it up a little bit, and then we're gonna switch sides, and then we get into round one. For three, two, and one, back to that jump rope. And let's turn it to the other side. Starting with that jab. Here we go, just the jab with the front arm. Tummy's in, torso tight, lean into it. Four, three, back arm is gonna cross punch, cross punch. Make sure your guard is up. Keeping all these muscles Activated the whole time. 
They're gonna act tough, even if you don't feel tough. Let's put these two together. We jab it and cross, jab and cross, jab. Twist, coming onto that back toe. Let's speed it up, here we go. Jab, cross. Really bring it back quickly for four, three, two, and one. Here we go. We're going to hook it, uppercut, hook it, uppercut. Pretend like you're hitting something, so you're stopping that fist. Good. Coming at him from this side and under. A few more here. And under. Good for three, two, and one. Back to that jump rope. I hope you're warm. That was our warm up. Starting with round one. I'm gonna show you the move first, and then we're gonna go through it a little bit quicker again, each move three times. First move is high knees. Super easy, right? Reach those arms up above, draw the knee up, tummy's tight. Bring those elbows down. But after this, we do jacks. So instead of jumping jacks, which you can do if you want, this is a nice modification with some side tap jacks. So we're just stepping alternating feet out to the side. So putting these together, we're gonna do four high knees, four jacks. Here we go. High knee, two, three, four, jack it, three, two, and one. Again, maybe move up here, travel a little bit. And back for four, three, two, one. Again, high knees. And back, jumping jacks if you want. If you wanted to add a little bounce to your high knees, you could too. Just trying to give you guys lots of options so this workout works for lots of people. Again, high knees. Take it back. One more time, high knees. And back, two, three, and four. Next move, we're gonna kick it and jab it front at the same time. One leg, guard is up, right arm punching that left, arm and leg. You can keep your kicks low, down here if you want to, or up to waist height. Bring it back, kick it, bring it back. All right, second part to this move. Taking a little side step, and then we hook it and bring it back. Step, bring it back. Again, a little force behind that arm. Really working the shoulder. Give me two more singles, and then we're gonna put these two together. Here we go. Kick it and punch it. Step it out. Forward and side. Forward and side. Flex the foot when you kick. Good. Give me three, two, and one. Other side. Start with just the kick and punch. Both go straight out, flexing that foot, and snap them back. Good. Three more singles here. Two, and one. Out to the side with that hook. Step out to the side, knees stay bent, and you're pushing off. Three more singles. We put it together. Here we go. Kick it and side. Punch, hook it, kick. Making your guys brain work too here. And punch. Kick it and punch two more. Nice job. Last move in round one, speed bag. Separate those feet, bend those knees. Arms are way up here, overhead, elbows out. Give me a speed bag and bounce the heels just like this. We're going around the world. Four, three, change it to the center. Keep it nice and high. Tummy's in. 
Wow, I know you feel those shoulders. Other corner, here we go. Now take it to the lower corner. Eight, seven, as fast as you can. Four, three, to the center. Six, five, four, three, two, lower corner. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. We're back to those high knees. Here we go, second time. Jack it back, four, three, two, and one. High knees for four. Back four, three, two, and one again. Are you breathing? Again for four, three, two, one. Back for four, three, two more times, guys. Up, travel tummy in, back. Last time, we go back to those jabs and kicks with the side hook. Here we go, jab, hook it. Going right into it for four, three, then we change sides, two. Here we go, punch it, hook it, punch it, hook it. Nice job for four, three, and we're back to the around the worlds. Here we go for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Take the center, elbows wide, arms stay nice and high. Other corner, breathe. Take it down low for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, back to center. Shoulders down. Last time, the corner for eight, seven, six, five. One more time, guys. High knees, here we go. Four, three, two, take it back. Two, three, four. So this is the last time we do these moves. Then we go on to round two with three new moves. Just so you guys get the pattern and you know what to expect. Anytime you need to pause and take a break, please do so. Get some nice cold water. Back, two, three, one more time. Front. Get ready for those kicks and jabs. Here we go, kick it. Put some power behind it. Kick it and jab it. Four, for three, two, other side. Kick it, hook it. Don't forget to keep your guard up on that other side. I just let mine down. One more. Last time, speed bag. Here we go for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, to the center. Little bounce in those knees. Tommy's in. Other corner. Almost there, guys. Lower corner, eight, seven, as fast as you can. Three, two, back to center. Four, three, two, and last corner for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Nice job. Bring that heart rate down just a bit. Take a nice deep breath. Inhale. Exhale. Beautiful job. That was round one. Now we are on to round two. Got some good side kicks on this one. What we're gonna do is three side taps with the toes, and then we're gonna kick it. Same time each side. So we're gonna tap the toe, tap the toe, tap the toe, kick it side. That's it. Tap, always starting with that same left leg, kick the right. Tap it, tap it, tap it, kick. Tap it, tap it, tap it, kick it. Keep that foot low. 
want you to use your core here because you're giving it a little lean. Flex that foot. Think about kicking with the heel. Tap it, tap and kick. Two more. Tap, tap, tap and kick. You guessed it, other side. Start with that right leg. Tap, 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 kick left. Side, side, side. You got it. Guard stays up. Side, side. Nice work, guys. Stay with me. One more time. Side, side, side. Kick it. Nice job. Next move. Stepping back with that right leg into a lunge. I hear you. You don't all love lunges. If you don't love lunges, I want you just to step back with that foot. And then we've got a knee drive. So stepping back into a lunge, knee drive, or just a tap here, a step back with the knee drive. You do you. We've got eight of them all on that right leg. Here we go. Take it back, knee up, back, knee up. Think about you're grabbing someone's shoulders and kneeing them right in the guts. Knee, hit it. Four, three, two, and one. Nice job, other side. Same thing, either a big lunge or a little tap. We come up and knee, back, knee. If you're lunging, go way back with that foot. Weight is in that front heel. Four, three, two, and one. Nice job, third move. Coming into a nice big sumo squat here. Feet are wide, toes to the corners, and we're gonna punch it. Tummy's in. Punching to the corners with a nice torso twist here. I want you to really feel this in your core. Snap those arms back. Combination with this one. We're gonna kind of do a combination of a hit block behind us, come up, hit behind us, and come up. So down, up, down, up. All right, so we're gonna put these two together. Four cross punches and two alternating little smacks behind us. Here we go. We've got four, three, two, one, and hit it, and hit it again. Four, three, two, one, bam, bam. Take it back, take it back. Working some of the back of the body here. So good for those triceps. Again, four, three, two, one. Take it back, take it back one more time. Four, three, two, one, back and back. Guess what? We're back to our second part. Side kicks, taps come first. Tap it, tap it, tap it, kick it. All right. This was just two moves ago. You know it. Kick it. You're nice and warm now. You know what you're doing. Kick it low or high. We'll put a little force behind it. Good. Three more. You got this. Two. Last one. Change sides. Tap it, tap it, tap it. Kick left. Tap, tap, tap it. Kick it. Good time to catch our breath here. Nice rhythmic move. Two more times. After this, come our lunges. Here we go. Either a lunge or a step back and knee. Back. Huh. Give me four, three, two, 
And one, switch sides straight into it. We go back. Back. Got to you breathing, guys. For four, three, two, back to those cross punches. Nice and wide, here we go. Four, three, two, one. Hit it back, hit it back. Four, three, two, one. Keep the core engaged. Good. Four, three, two, one. Four, three, two, one. Hit it back and back. Two more. Hit it back. Last one. Nice job. Third time, guys. Third time's a charm. Three side taps with a kick. Here we go. Tap it, tap it, and kick it. Woo! Tap, tap, kick it. Stay with me. More power. Keep going, side to side. Two more this side. Tap it, tap it, and kick it. Other side. Here we go, kick left. Give me a little lean with that side kick. Working those obliques. Tap, tap. Stay with me, guys. This is our third one. Last time on the second round. Two more, side, side, tap it. Last one, sumo squat, cross punches. We go four, hit it back, hit it back. Four, three, two, one, and back, back. Tighten up those arms. Four, three, two, one, back, back. Try to keep your knees pressed out to the side. Four, three, two, one, back, back. Two more. Nice, four, three, two, one, back and back. Nice job. Get that drink of water, keep moving, catch your breath, because we are ready for round three. Okay, starting out a little bit slower with this one, two side taps. Let's drop our hands to our waist. Ooh, guys, got my sweat on. How about you? To these side steps, we're gonna add a hamstring curl. So just two steps to the side, taking that leg, heel comes up towards the bum. Let's add a punch. Same arm as leg. Hamstring curl with that punch. It's a little break, guys. For right now, we've got more coming. Two more, side and side. Coming to a nice wide stance. Feet flat on the floor, toes forward. Tummy is in, your guard is up. Really want you to activate that core, pull the belly button to the spine, bend those knees, and give me some nice quick twist, twist, twist. So this is all coming from the core. I don't want your hips to move at all. Really, really isolating that waistline. We're gonna do four or five twists, and then we're gonna add a knee. So it looks like this. One, two, three, four. Knee up. One, two, three, four. Huh. Keep it going here. Same knee. Huh. Nice. Last one. Let's switch sides. Start with just that twist. This time we're gonna pick up that right knee. Twist, 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 knee. Twist, twist. Huh. Really drive that knee inside. Right, so it's not straight up. 
We've got a little twist. Huh. Good. Keep those knees bent. Keep that tummy in. Good. Last one. Coming back to center. Taking your right leg. We're going to curtsy back. Again, if you don't want to curtsy back or come low to a lunge, then you're just going to step back here. Then we've got directly into another side kick. So we go sit and kick. Take some balance here. We're going nice and slow. If you need to hold onto a chair or maybe your wall, please do so. Either step that foot way back or just tap it back behind you with a kick. Two more. Other side. Leg comes back, find your balance, and kick it. Back, kick. Nice and slow. Good. Three, two. We're going back to those two side steps with the hamstring curl and the punch. Remember this? This is our second time through. Going a little bit quicker this time because we're not breaking down each move. Good job, find your breath. Keep it here. Then we go back to those twists. Two more. Good, hold it here. Twist, 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 knee. Twist, 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 knee. I got off on that one. There we go. Twist, 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 knee. If you guys ever go by yourselves or get off, who cares? Join back in when you can. This is tough. I honestly thought the last kickboxing class might have been too tough, but you guys loved it. Other side. Twist, twist, bring it in. Good. Twist, twist, and knee. Two more. Then we go to those curtsies with our kicks. Here we go. Coming back with that right foot, curtsy or tap it back, side kick. Side kick. Again, hold on to a chair or a wall if you need to. And kick. Two more. Take it other side, left leg comes back, kick it straight out to the side. Good, you guys, this takes a lot of control and balance. A little harder to put some force behind it because we're balancing. Good, two more. Nice job. Last time, guys, two side steps, hamstring curl. Last time with these moves. Then we get three new moves in our last round. Hamstring curl, punch it out. If you're working too hard, lose the arms and just do the feet. You gotta make a lot of these workouts your own. You do you, I always say, right? A few more here. Back to those twists. Twist, 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 knee. Really important to keep that core engaged right here. Belly button in, it stays pulled in the whole time. Your hips aren't moving. One more this side. Other side. Huh. Good. Twist, 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 knee. See if you can get your elbows on the outside of that thigh. Two more. And then we've got, thank God, our last set of curtsy kicks. Here we go. 
curtsy lunge and kick down almost there guys four three those thighs should be burning other side take it back and kick back kick go slower or faster if you need to whoa I was lost in that one <laughs> nice job guys you probably did better than me on that last one here we go last one stay with me round four we're going to work a little bit into our glutes here so we've got three alternating kicks to the front one to the back starting with that right leg so we're going to go kick 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 back with that right leg kick it front two three kick it back front two three and back so when you're kicking front i want you to think about almost leaning back a little bit and then when you kick to the back you've got a little lean front kick it two three kick it back one two three kick it back one two three back back last one then we're going to switch sides kick it back starting with that left leg three kicks front kick it back front two three kick it back put some force behind him guys no wimpy kicks think about you're kicking someone in the shins behind you kick it good two more last one excellent face the side towards me feet are nice and wide I want you to give me a couple little jabs here to the corners rotating that torso a little bit jab it jab it bring it back now we're going to add that front foot stepping forward matching the arms so it's a little hop here back foot stays planted on the floor we're just using that front foot to give us a little bit more leverage i know you're getting tired stay with me all right last part to this move we're going to double it up so i want you to go fast feet two punches two punches to the corners fast feet for four three two and one other side starting with those jabs jab it keep that elbow nice and high and guard stays up let's add that front foot same corner as that arm good let's double it up fast feet double arms last round guys give it up all you've got for three two and one bring it down all right, I want you to come to a nice wide straddle here. Toes are facing forward. We get a little break here. Sitting those hips back, hinging from the hips. Come down low. I want you to straighten this one side and really bend this knee. Bend both knees. Sink your hips down and come to the other side. I know it. So we're just doing a nice slow motion here, like a little side lunge. Sitting those hips down and back. So it's kind of like a real deep bob and weave. Now come to the center and I want you to come straight up, punch the arms up and then if you'd like to, up on your heels four times. Down, lift, down, lift, down, push it up and down, push it up. Let's do that again. Nice and slow for one two three hips are back come to the center up and reach squat it down 
Good. You can always come a little nearer with those legs. Give me one more and push it up. All right, that was it. Guess what? Two more times in that round, a little faster. And then we're gonna cool it down. Starting with those three front kicks and the one to the back. Here we go. Three, two, one, back. Keep breathing, kick it back. Tummy's in, little lean back, little lean forward. Two more times, kick it. And back, front. And back, let's switch sides. Kick it, kick it. Right leg back, kick. And back. Woo, we're working hard, guys. I am right here with you. Two more, kick it. And back, kick it. And back, back to the side with those jabs. Jab it, jab it. To the corners. Add that foot. Good, get that guard up. Here come our doubles. Two punches. Fast feet. Three, two, and one. Other side, going right into it. We jab, jab. Little torso twist. Guard up, let's add that foot. Good, four, three, two, double it up. Almost there for three, two, and one. Coming back to those nice low toe forward, stationary lunges, sink it low, straighten the leg, through center, straighten the other leg. Hips are down and back, so really think about sitting those hips way back. So good for those inner thighs. Bring it back to center. We lift and rise up on those heels if you can. Down, punch it up. Down and punch. Down and punch. Sit back one more time. Lunge it side. Your thighs should be screaming. You can scream at me if you want to. We're almost there. Back to center, here we go. Lift, down, lift and punch. Down and lift, down and lift. Last time, guys. Back to those kicks. Here we go. Kick it, kick it to the back. Front, 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 and back. Last time through it. You got this. Stay with me. You've made it this far. You can finish. Nice. Kick it, kick. Force behind it. Don't leave anything on the floor. You can always take a break, but jump right back in. One more. I want you to hold that back kick. Kick it, kick it. A little bonus here at the end for you. Four, three, switching sides. Here we go. Kick it. Back with the right. Front, two. Good. Give it to me, kick it. You know what you're doing now. One more, hold those back kicks. Here we go, kick it, kick it back, kick it back. Working those glutes, four, three, two, and one. Last time, corner jabs, jab. Protect your beautiful face. Let's add the foot. Front, side, or corner, corner. Following that arm. No more wimpy arms. This is it. Let's double it up. Fast feet. Ooh. 
four, three, faster, two, and one, other side, corner, corner. Breathe, almost there, add the foot, push off, good, for four, three, two, double it up, two punches, each corner, fast feet, four, three, two, and one, Oh, holy moly. We got this. Nice wide stance again. Squat it down, side to side. If you don't want to come into a full squat, and still spread those legs nice and wide to the sides and lunge side to side for those inner thighs. Come to center, push it up onto our tippy toes, sit back down, lift, core is in. One more time, squat it down. Side to side, nice and low. Back to center, we lift, squat for three, two, and one. Bring it down, and guess what? You're done with round four, but I've got one, quick one more quick move for you for a bonus round. Here we go, bonus round, one more move for the core. We're gonna do some nice corner knee drives. Our arms are gonna come up at an angle and bring them down as our knee comes over. So we cross, pull it, pull it. So kind of like the twist that we did, really getting into those obliques by taking the arms all the way up overhead. If this is too much for you, we can do something like this. I want you to work in those obliques. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Take it to the other side. Working with both the upper and lower body, crossing that midline to really get that twist. Core is super tight. And this is it, guys. Give me eight, seven, six. Reach and pull. Four. Three, two, and one. March it out. Take a deep breath. Give yourself a hand because that was amazing. You are amazing for getting through that. I don't care how you got through it. If it took you a week doing one round each day, you did it. Big deep breath, arms go up. Exhale, bring them down. Again, arms go up. Bring that heart rate down. Inhale up. And exhale down. Separate those feet. They're just hip width apart. Take those arms up nice and high. Lace those fingertips together. Big stretch up and take it to the side. Beautiful stretch in that side body. Back to center. And other side. And then go ahead and bend those knees, round the arms towards me, palms are in. Go ahead and round that back and just sit back a little bit, really stretch the arms up towards me, then switch the palms towards me, round that back. Drop the head to look at the floor. Good, keeping that stretch in the arms, I would just want you to turn to the corner. So you'll feel it in the back of your shoulder and maybe your lower back. Back to center, other side. Back to center, drop the hands on our knees, bend our knees and let's round it up one vertebrae at a time. Arms are to come up, big inhale. As you exhale, I want you to reach forward with a flat back, reach straight towards me and try to keep your knees straight. Just only go down as far as you can right here. Nice big reach, inhale, exhale, take them on top of the thighs again. Once more, bend the knees, tummy in, and round that back up. One vertebrae at a time. Next, I want you to do a, my favorite stretch is a figure four. In a standing position, if you need to, hold on to a chair or to a wall. 
we're going to cross one ankle over that knee and sit those hips back. Flexing that top foot. Again, I need a wall too after that. Sit back. Feel that great stretch in the sides of your hips. And other side. Cross that ankle and sit those hips back. Holy moly, you guys, am I sweating? Continue to take nice deep breaths. And let's come out of that. Separate those feet again. Clasp your hands behind you. Try to straighten your elbows. And let's lean over with a little knee bend and pick those arms up gently if you can. So many punches today. We want to release those shoulders. Inhale. Exhale, let's drop those arms. Reach towards the floor. Rounding that lower back one more time. Bend the knees and round it up nice and slow. Some big shoulder rolls back. You guys did it. If you need more stretching, I can put a link at the bottom in the description of this video below with my stretch routine. But for now, I really worked, you guys. I think this was enough. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you love this workout. Give it a like for me. Share with your friends. Subscribe if you haven't already. Leave me a comment. Let me know how sweaty you got to. And I'll see you next time. Bye.